my lovelies welcome to my channel here we are doing the monthly readings this is going to be for cancer sun moon rising and venus how, how are you cancer hope you guys are doing amazing i hope you guys are excited as i am for spring uh, it is the beginning of a new month the possibilities are endless let's say optimistic and positive uh, let's look into your situation let's see exactly what's going on cancer for those of you guys returning, welcome back, my lovelies. For those of you guys that are new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you guys can get notified of the most recent videos going up. We have tons of new tarot readings as well as spell videos coming through for you guys, so definitely stay tuned for that. All right, let's get into it. Spirit guides, ancestors, and archangels, what are the messages for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of April 2022? Let's see what you can expect, Cancer. What is unfolding for you guys for this month? April 2022, Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. We're going to do a little bit of a free hand here. As you guys know, I always shuffle my cards on camera. But we're also going to be um, reading energies here. So let's get into your reading, Cancer. Now, your first card here for the month of April is the Fool card. This is a very positive card, very optimistic type of energy. This is being refreshed. This is being refocused for some of you guys. You may be thinking or pondering about new endeavors or taking on a new project, uh, something that uh, you're really putting your effort or intention towards. For some of you guys, you may be dealing with an Aries for the month of April. Next card here is the Five of Wands. So for some of you guys, it could be an Aries or uh, someone that is uh, being symbolized here as the full card energy um, could be that you're a little bit innocent in regard to a situation where there is a bit of hostility, uh, perhaps dealing with family issues, uh, not being able to see eye to eye or perhaps having different opinions. I'm hearing for a lot of you guys, you may be dealing with a situation where um, it's like a lot of people, a lot of opinions. Uh, try not to take it personal for this month, Cancer. Uh, don't allow people to get you out of character or to push you, um, to push you to the point of uh, basically going off on people. Uh, it's very important to maintain your composure in this situation. Uh, whatever the situation you may be dealing with, for some of you guys, it could be that there's almost a feeling of having the need to fight for the attention of your partner or person of interest. If that's the case, again, Bring it back to yourself and focus on yourself and your projects or new beginnings that are unfolding in your life, whereas entertaining the thought or the feeling of jealousy may not really lead you anywhere. So again, if you are dealing with a situation where you feel like your partner is being a bit immature um, and they are you know, doing actions or taking actions that uh, try to get you know, a reaction out of you, try to be a little bit more methodical about that and... Um, the moment we lose our composure, the moment we lose ourselves based on emotion is the moment that we kind of lose the battle, right? Why? Because we are allowing people um, to really dig into our vulnerabilities. And that's something that they're asking you at this present time to be in control of. So again, do not surrender uh, or do not give in to your emotions, even if it really upsets you. Um, because I feel like people are just going to be taunting just to get a rise out of you. So be mindful and careful about that. Your next card here is the Nine of Pentacles. So for some of you guys, you're going on this new endeavor or on this new journey where you're feeling a little bit more refocused. Perhaps for some of you guys, even feeling a little bit more aggressive than usual when we're talking about competition, especially in the career finances sector. Um, what they're telling you here is, again, be methodical. Uh, don't allow the emotions to get the best of you, but also... Uh, take a step back and really analyze people and how they're acting or how they're expressing. Oftentimes, people will tell us one thing, but their actions are showing us another thing. Um, for some of you guys, it could be that uh, those that, you know, up and swear that they have your back and they have uh, your best interest at heart, um, you may actually catch them either being, you know, being a bit of a snake or... Uh, talking and expressing a certain way about you around other people when they think you're not there. Take it for what it is. Again, do not lose your composure. It is important and crucial uh, to maintain that um, that dignity, that, that power of not allowing people to get a rise out of you. 
you'll come out on top for sure, Cancer, but I feel like you're definitely going to be challenged with people and their intentions uh, towards you for this month. And finally, we have the Knight of Wands. I see a lot of opportunities for you guys in regards to finances and career. For some of you guys, it may be or could have been a long journey uh, where there's been a lot of inconsistencies uh, or a bit of lack of stability. But that's quickly going to be changing for you guys. Um, what they're saying here is there is an opportunity that is coming towards you that is going to help you or bring to you more financial stability. Although it may take, uh, may take some type of effort on your part. As an example, it could be picking up a shift that you're not used to. For others of you, it could be commuting uh, or going to a place that is a little bit more further than what you're currently working at. But again, I feel like this is positive energy. Why? Because there's a shift that's changing. Where we have a bit of innocence or a bit of the feeling of trusting or trusting perhaps people we shouldn't be trusting with the five of wands here uh, people that are secretly in competition with you and the nine of pentacles with the knight of wands sorry with the knight of pentacles uh, is definitely talking about being the mature one um, but also again keeping your composure if you can see here the nine of pentacles is very regal she's very still um she is in in retrospect, she's, you know, uh, in the backdrop, uh, kind of looking or scoping things out at the same time, like I said, being very opulent, right? Opulence is all around her. So what they're telling you here is uh, really pay attention to what is unfolding or to people's behaviors or their actions, but ultimately never lose your temper or your control of your temper. Be more graceful. Why? Because in the in the long run it's going to benefit you could be potentially that there's someone of a higher ranking that will be looking into you or that is looking to see if you can handle some type of stress situation so again um keep your composure for this month cancer i hope that this gives you insight understanding and we'll see each other soon till then bye